Howdy, people! Zarthwamp here, and welcome to episode 8 of Donkey Kong 64. Last time, we collected some more bananas as Tiny, and got her gear. We got her instruments, we got her shrinking power, and we got her crossbow gun. And we took on a beetle in a race, and won. Yes, the infamous beetle race has been vanquished. And now, with that, we are going to head back to the temple. The Temple of the Llama. The Temple of the Lost Llama. And let's go. Okay. Let's see. All right, there it is. Because we can do some stuff in there. We can do some stuff. I think as Lanky, I think we can do some stuff in there as Tiny. But all in all, we got stuff we can do in there. Okay. Yeah, look at this. Lanky gets his own side of the temple. Okay, let's head on in. Okay. Anything for Tiny in here? Ah, okay, there's another pad. Hey, how did I not notice that? Do, 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 do. Let me just check down here. I just want to make sure. Just want to make sure that there's nothing that I'm missing out in Lanky's Chamber of Doom. Okay. Nothing, nothing. Aha! All right, yeah. Lanky had some had those bananas that we could grab. Okay, come on. How am I so inaccurate with the grape? Okay. There. Okay. Nice. We now have we now have Lanky's banana medal. Okay, good thing we came back to check, because otherwise I would have forgotten about this. Okay, nothing else. Just want to make sure. Just want to make sure. Okay, let's head down. And... Okay. Anything? Okay. Get me up. Okay. Boom. Okay, we've already we already came there with Donkey Kong's bongos, which woke up the llama. The real I can never think of you know, though I can never think of this place without associating with Carl Weezer from Jimmy Neutron. Jimmy, I found the lost animal of the llama! Almighty llama! Help me hook up with Jimmy's mom! Okay. Okay. Dum dum dum. Okay, and there's apparently a tiny banana in a tiny balloon. Yeah, I'll collect these. Rejuvenate our ammo. Ow! Okay, I did not realize that was a slope. I am very sorry, Lanky. And... Welcome to bonus. Teeter and Turtle Trouble! We gotta save the turtles! Keep the turtles spinning by feeding the snakes melons. For say a fire melon. Okay, you just gotta do this over and over again. Okay. Okay, I know to keep going. 
Okay, and there we go. The turtles have been saved and we are all good. Banana, please. Okay. Nice, nice. Okay. Come on, get out of the water. Okay, I know there's a barrel here. Okay. Let me go and get get tiny out. Okay. Okay. Ah, uh -huh, there we go. Okay. Okay, it's over there. Okay, thought I got rid of that. Okay. Come on. Make my day, balloon. Make my day. Okay, that balloon's got to come back here sooner or later. I can wait. I can wait. I can wait two seconds. What am I saying? I can't wait that two seconds. Okay, there we go. Okay, nice. Okay, we don't have that banana border up. And we almost have Tiny's banana metal. Nice. Okay. Let's go. Lanky, you can open that door. Okay. And for defeating these guys, we get a but we get these ropes. I feel so rewarded right now. Okay. Jump. Okay, nice. I am willing to risk it for the coin. The things I'm willing to do for a banana coin. Okay. Let's get some more ammo. Okay. And get ready for some matching games. Okay, perfect match. Okay. Let's see. Okay. That would make it where Okay. Okay. And there we go. Easy as that. Don't make Lanky crotch shot you. He will. Okay, Lanky just has one more banana than his blueprint. Okay. Let's search around. 
Okay, Tiny has her area. Okay, so let's go there next. Jump. Okay. And... Tiny time! Okay... Let's get going into the barrel! Okay, in we are! And here's where the second banana port is, as well as, as well as the map, okay? Okay, first off, we'll cover this area. Okay, just want to make sure I didn't hit my mute button by accident. Ah, no! Okay, a little embarrassing, but hey, we made it. Okay. And you can see death for the first time, as just she floats in the in the in the lava. And as you can see, we're just sent back to the beginning of the level. No real big issue. No shame in dying. No shame in dying. We have a war point. We have the war points active, so it's not like, oh, hey, you lost all this progress. This game is actually relatively lenient when it comes to death. So, yeah, no, no hard feelings. In fact, that actually works out well for us because that means that we could actually go and get those, get those last banana balloons from the temple. Okay. Darn you. Okay. Grab. Okay. I think that's good. Okay. Come on. Ah, there we go. There's the tiny pat. There's the tiny switch. Okay. And into the drink we go. Okay. Okay, is there a tiny barrel in here? Okay. Ah, there we go, tiny barrel. Okay, nothing there. Okay. Into the war we go. Really, thankfully, tiny's a bit, tiny's tiny power just waste has drained so little okay 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 come on Bring it! Okay, another banana. 
And we almost have the fifth one. Nothing in here. Thankfully, in areas like this where you cannot unshrink, the game will not drain your crystal coconuts. On the grounds that basically, well, if you get stuck there, you're kind of out of luck. Okay, there's an area for Lanky. Okay, are the enemies extra large in here in this room, or is it just me? Okay. Okay, and there's that one banana that we can get later on. Okay, we'll head out, get Lanky, then get his banana. Then basically we can head out and we can warp to, we can go to the temple and then we can warp and then basically we can get the blueprint and then we can try again with with Tiny. Okay, we're getting things wrapped up. But yeah, just with Donkey Kong 64's levels, while they can be engaging, the thing is that there is a lot going on. Even at this point in the game, there is plenty that you need to compartmentalize, and just there's a lot that's going around. So basically, the key to it is just knowing what you're doing, is basically just having a general idea, just focusing one Kong at a time. Just thinking, okay, what, what can I do with the Kong that I am currently out? And then just doing as much as you can with them, and then tr and then basically moving on to another one when you find the barrel. Okay. Though as I said before, in terms of just overall flow, I would say that I definitely prefer this game over Banjo Tooie. Okay. Though speaking of which, I have to admit after doing ukulele. Basically, I have to admit that basically ukulele was a lot more solid of a game than I gave it credit for. And there's the arena, but we can't use that at the moment. Okay. Now watch how we end up getting all the bananas here. Okay, there's a single lanky bunch somewhere in the world. Okay, and there it is. Once again, we gotta feed the heads. Actually, no, we have to fire at this vulture. Okay. Okay, or technically it's not a vulture, it is a klept, uh, it's not a klepto. Okay. It's a necky, it's a necky. Even though it doesn't look like a typical Neki from the Donkey Kong series, the Donkey Kong Country series. Okay. And as you can see, now he's really tiny. And... Okay, how is he capable of carrying that banana at this point? Okay. Okay. There we go, we've destroyed him. And as if to celebrate Lanky's might, the, the water drains, revealing the arena pad for this level. And now we just need to get now we just need to get the blueprint and we'll have Lanky's final banana. Critter car Critter Carnage. 
yeah, Lanky is pretty much nigh invincible in this one. It's just the like the first one, except with Kremlings instead of Beavers. And with Lanky's ground attack, he's nigh invincible. Lanky could just stand there and just crotch shot them all. Look at this. Lanky doesn't even have to move. He can just punch them all in the crotch. Get out my purse! I don't know you! Okay. Okay. With that. Okay. Four out of five for Lanky. We just need to get his blueprint and we'll have all of his bananas for this area. And Lanky will be officially done. Okay. Yeah, watch how Lanky just becomes the absolute highlight of this playthrough. You know it's gonna happen. Just, I am going to just, I am just gonna ride the idea of Lanky just being the one true king of Donkey Kong Island. Just Lanky becoming the one true Chad. Frankly, screw, screw it. We need Lanky, we need Lanky Jungle Beats. We're basically Lanky. He doesn't have his bongos. He has a freaking trombone. And he's just absolutely rocking everything. Just Lanky. He, uh, you, know the, you know the Kong fights in Jungle Beat where basically Donkey Kong, he's fighting them on mano e mano fist fight. Basically, now I'm imagining something like that, but Lanky just, he just crotch shying them all. Just absolute dishonor. Just cr Lanky, Dread Kong, he's there. He's pounding his chest. Crotch shot. Basically, the hog boss is crotch shot. Nothing can withstand the crotch shot. And basically, Lanky's just dropping them all one hit. <laughs> Boom! Just dead. Though, frankly, I mean, you can't underestimate the power of the crotch shot. Because basically, just every guy can attest that basically, you can hit in the crotch. It hurts like heck. You don't, you basically can barely move. It's game over at that point. Just, you just give up. It's just, no, I can't do it. I am, I am weak. My body, my mind wants to fight, but my body has been absolutely taken. What, what, why am I on this topic all of a sudden? Why am I on this topic? This is what happens when I'm doing this at nine o'clock at night and I'm excited and I'm enjoying myself. I'm getting into the game. I'm becoming one with the game. Okay, nothing over there. Where's the, te where's the, the llama? Okay, okay, whoopee. Good job, Lanky. Good job. You get to go over there. Okay, yeah. Okay. Yeah, Lanky just running with that, with that blowgun right in his mouth. Yeah, really, Lanky just goes in there, just punches Funky in the crotch. He gets his ultimate victory. Okay, go in, go in. Frankly, we need Lanky Kong in the next Smash Bros. game. We're gonna, we're gonna petition it. We need another Donkey Kong character, and frankly, Lanky would be the ideal. Lanky would have range. Basically, Lanky would have long reach. Basically, we have seen this done with Min Min. So basically, we know that Lanky can rock it. We know that Lanky has the potential. Lanky would essentially be a Donkey Kong version of Min Min. Really, it could happen. We could do it. We could make it work. Lanky for Smash Bros. He has a bunch of throw attacks. I mean, look at this. Spinning. And there we go. Though, so, yeah, we're going to do that all over again. There's at least... Okay. Let's go. This time, I am going to create a restore point just in case things go awry. Just because it's hard to jump back on the platform after, the lo after you fall into the lava. Oh, no, you don't. Okay, anyways. My plan for this episode, I'm going to basically get the rest of the stuff. And then we can go challenge the boss. Okay. 
Tiny, it's you and me. It is our destiny. You teach me, and I teach you. Pokemon. Okay. Let's go. K. Rule and his unlimited army. Really? Why doesn't K. Rule just send his his never dying army and just do a mass invasion of the island? I mean, Donkey Kong and the rest have been, and the rest of his crew has been have been shown to be overpowered. So why not just mass attack the island? Attack it with every Kremlin you got. Okay. Create a restore point. Okay. Okay, I could have just done that. I didn't realize you could do that in the lava. Okay. Okay, do I need crystal coconuts? Yep, I could use some. Okay. Okay. Okay, good, good. Turn that round. No, no, don't fall off, don't fall off, don't fall off. Okay. Okay. And final banana bunch. And the final and the final gold banana that we can get in this level for the time being. Okay. Jump. Actually, no, we still have to get one with Lanky, but that's not a big deal. Okay, even if we die at this point, it's not going to be the end of the world. Okay. If we can make it with one HP, that would actually be really nice. Okay, I think we can do it. I think we can do it. There's always a chance. There's always a chance to succeed. And nope, we slide off the platform. At least we don't lose any of the golden bananas. We don't lose any of the blueprints. We get dumped back with a bunch of ammo, so everyone comes out a winner. Okay, let's go. At least we got the banana. Okay. Lanky, you're out. You're up. Okay. Let's go. Warpad number two. Okay. I think it's Warpad four that we'd want to take. Just because it's right in the neighborhood. Okay, let's find Snide. Okay, Snide, your HQ needs to be found. Snide, Snide. Okay, Snide, ah, there's Snide H Snide's HQ. Okay, let's head over there. Okay. And final golden banana for Lanky. So yeah, we're pretty much done with. So yeah, we'll only need to come back here once in order to get some more. In order to basically get Chunky's bananas once we unlock him. But for the time being. Let's check the blueprints. Pretty nice. Pretty nice.
Okay. Let's make our way over there. Make our way to the boss. Okay. Here's a boss entrance. And before you ask, and if you're curious, just if you leave an inch if you leave a boss entrance, a boss room, then basically you get dumped out at the entrance that you took. Anyways, this little area right here, I forgot to mention. This tells you how many of bananas of a Kong that basically that scoff has eaten. So yeah, if you ever feel like so basically, if you're ever curious, you're thinking, okay, I'm running, I need to feed Scoff more bananas. Who can I go? Who can I get some bananas as? But anyways, we can still feed him with one Kong. So let's feed. Okay, actually, no, we, we need two Kongs. Okay, we'll go in. Donkey Kong, you can feed him all yours. Yeah, as you can see, we now have to have 120 bananas. Meaning that basically, between the four Kongs that we have, we would need about, we would need 30 bananas each. Which is pretty reasonable, if I do say so myself. You just can't get on your tippy toes, can ya? Okay. And Diddy, you can come on out. As you can see from here, we have given him 100 Diddy of uh, Donkey's bananas. But we only need to give him 20 of Diddy's. Okay, let's go. Yeah, a literal dragonfly. Yeah, Diddy, I don't think the parent likes that. Similar to Army Dillo's fight. Just dodge the projectiles. He criticized you. I think it's a he. Anyways, throw the barrel. Go into the lava. Anyways, this is actually a little easier than Army Dillo's. I think the only difference is that the flames actually have a bit of a shockwave to them. Boom! Yes, the ultimate attack, scolding! Okay. Ow! Okay. Go land. And I think that's it. And with that, the boss is defeated. And we can now leave the level. Okay, let's head out. Okay. I have an itch in my eye. I hate when that sort of thing happens. Frankly, I don't think I've ever really had a use for the long jump. Just 
kind of weird that I, now that I think about it. Okay. Let's go over here. And... Let's go. Okay, thank you, fast transport. Okay. Let's head out. Okay. And we are back. Okay, as you can see, we have so we have an area we can access as Tiny. tiny so let's go, Tiny. <laughs> oh, come on, that hit. Okay. As you can see, we don't really have an area that we can utilize. We don't have. We can't really utilize that for the time being. Yeah, we don't have an area where we can utilize that. We can't. Yeah, we don't. We can't bring this giant switch over to a new area. We have to work with what we've got. Okay, we can't do anything with this just yet. Okay, let's leave. Okay, can't do anything there just yet. Okay, nope. But we can do a little something at the... Oh, no! Worth it! Speedrun tactic! Okay, first off, we'll head over here. Okay. Anyways, welcome to Banana Fairy Island. Okay. First off, we have a golden banana that we can get with, with Tiny. I love that. Oh, banana. Okay, and Tiny's first banana. Okay. Okay, there's the barrel. Okay, let's head inside. Okay. Yeah, there are a few crystal coconuts in the water. Okay, nothing we can get there. Okay, anyways, talk to this banana fairy. Oh, I just don't know what to do. There was this huge tremor recently, and it scared my banana fairy so much that they panicked and flew away. I'll reward anyone who manages to find them all and bring them back to me. Please help me, little one. <laughs> Calm down, Miss Fairy. My friends and I will look out for them on our adventure. <laughs> oh, thank you. But I'm afraid you won't be able to simply grab them out of the air. The only way to catch banana fairies is by trapping them inside special banana skin photographs. Here, take my magical camera. It already has some film in it. To activate the camera, press and hold C and then press down. Take a fairy's picture by pressing B as a sign of our friendship. I'll now teach you and your friends a secret ability. Press and hold B to power up. This move, and then release the button to activate it, as well as projecting you. Projecting you can also be useful for unearthing hidden items. Unfortunately, it needs a crystal coconut to work, so use it wisely. Very good technique. 
Got 10 film and a charge. I cannot do my Samugi voice anymore, apparently. Or at least I can't do it tonight. My voice must be too tired. I must be too excited. Okay. So anyways, if we run down any banana fairies, we can now deal with them. As you can see, there are four on four fairies on Donkey Kong Island. There are two in Angry Aztecs, which we've seen already. Two in Jungle Japes. And yeah. That's pretty much how it is for all the worlds. And with each banana fairy you collect, you actually get an additional crystal coconut. So it is your, in your best interest to get them all. If you find one, take a picture of it. No, oh, come on. Put that away. Okay. I'll go to the banana port. Okay. Let's go. And next key. Yeah, it's, yeah, do the K-Lumsy dance. And there's the third level. As well as an area underneath the, as well as an area underneath the island. Okay. Nothing over there. Except a lanky barrel that we can't really access. We do not have it at our disposal yet. But anyways, I think now would be a good time to end things off. Anyways, I really appreciate that you stuck around to watch this episode. You're a great viewer, and I hope you come back for the next one. If you like this video, like, subscribe, comment, share, do whatever you want. With that, I'll see you next time. Bye.